Okay, so Caleb here from Cell Phone Intelligence, and this video is uh, just an overview of some of the different cases you can get uh, for your Galaxy Note. So, uh, let's just get right into it here. So, starting off, uh, I'm going to start off with uh, this guy here. Oh, dusty. With the uh, rubber shell, and uh, this is a casemate rubber shell. So, jeez, where does all that dust come from? All right, I just gotta clean this off. Okay, this is ridiculous. Anyways, moving on. So, rubber shell covers the outside. Doesn't know exactly what it sounds like. Is what it sounds like. Um, so, uh, pros on this one here. Uh, cheap. This one here is the cheapest of them all. Nineteen ninety nine for this guy. Um, does enhance the grip um, on the sides as well, which is you know always something I'd say to look for because you know if it's just as slick with the case on it, you're just as likely to drop it, right? So, uh, for cost value, not too shabby. Um, but yeah, but uh, what else? Sorry, one of the drawbacks, one of the things I hate about these cases, is um, the fact that it just seems to absorb like you know any kind of oils or anything that you get on your hands. You know, even just like you know regular, you know your regular hand, you know greasiness, or if like you eat something, or even like you know, have a drink that has some kind of sugar in it, and you get it on your hands. It's gonna transfer right to this case, and then these things get all like disgusting and greasy so fast. So, so price-wise, not bad though. Uh, next here, we've got the uh, uh, Incipio, and uh, this one here is a uh, hard plastic shell. Uh, you know, easy enough to use, obviously. Just snaps on, bam, and. Yeah, so um, as far as protection, really great. I love the hard shell. Um, and even being the hard shell, um, it does have a, uh, does enhance the grip uh, nicely. And as well, you know, cool, you know, cool factor, like this is awesome. Like this is a great color blue. Um, other great feature, um, you can see here in the camera, you can see here in the cam where the camera is, um, it is recessed. So I can put the phone down. Whoop and not worry about, say, the camera lens getting scratched up um, just from being directly, uh, you know, on a hard surface. And uh, cost-effective as well. Uh, this one uh, was $24.99, so not, uh, not too bad there. And now it did come with a screen protector, and I do have a screen protector on here, but it is not the one that came with this case, uh, simply for the fact that I could not get it to, uh, I couldn't get it on properly. Um, the plastic that came, or the uh, screen protector that came with it um, was just cut um, so finely that it was the exact size of the screen, like perfectly. So it was impossible to line it up, trying to get the corner of the edges lined up and then smooth down, just couldn't do it. Like it just was not possible to get it all, you know, to get it perfectly lined up on all you know, on sides. So um, as far as the screen protectors you know, concerned, not so hot. But great case, um, looks great, works great, and uh, doesn't uh, doesn't increase the profile of the phone uh, very much at all. So it still keeps. You know, this is already a pretty bulky phone, you know. And then you, you know if you got a case that makes it even bulkier, um, you know that just makes it that much harder to put in your pocket or whatever. So moving on here, we got the uh, leather pouch, and so two sided pouch, leather of course, and this one uh, comes right from Samsung. So you know it's gonna fit <laughs> um, without any trouble. Uh, so now this one here, you know, great protection, especially against you know like uh, moisture spills, um, drops as well. Um, now you know drawbacks, it's tough to get out. Um, you kind of gotta give it one of these shimmies just to get it out of the far enough out of the pouch that you can actually get the phone out. Because I find, especially when you first get it, that the leather is so tough that you know your phone starts ringing you want to just grab it from the top here and you know it's it's a pain you know it's tough to pull it right out so until you work it in a little tough to get out but provides superior protection you know for screen you know, for the whole phone especially um, if you're gonna be you know if you put your phone in your purse um, if you're traveling you're leaving it in a bag something like that where it may be exposed to you know keys other elements like that that are gonna you know that can scratch a screen um, the leather pouch is the way to go, um, but 
another draw oh, big drawback most expensive um, out of the ones I have here uh, and it came in at $54.99 so uh, moving right along here and this is the uh, flip case and our flip cover sorry and uh, this one comes from Samsung as well and what it does is it's actually a replacement backer um, for the phone itself so so I've got my note here peel her up and whoop. then you're just going to uh, attach this backer instead now some of you uh, remembers you really got to uh, make sure that you uh, get this uh, inside edge uh, make sure that it is in place um, otherwise uh, the case is really ineffective uh, whereas the first time I dropped the phone with this case on it the backer flew right off and the battery came out and it was you know it was ridiculous and you feel stupid and this is not cool so um, great you know, great things about this case covers the front you know one of the only cases besides the pouch with an actual you know that actually protects the screen so you open her up and voila let's wipe this down a bit here and there you have it so as well um, this backer if you can kind of see it's uh, also recessed around the camera so once again you can put it down without worrying about scratching up the camera lens now drawbacks on this guy here a couple of big ones um, so not so great for say pocket use um, if you're using your phone uh, for mp3 anything like that because volume buttons covered up so you know I guess you, you can push them through here um, but it's hard to find where the buttons are just because there's you know it's like you know they're, you know they're around there somewhere right but you know if your volumes already really high and then you hit that up again that sucks so that's covered as well Great when you flip it around here, awesome. But taking a photo, you're covering up the camera. So, oops, get out of my inbox. So into the camera, and yeah, that's what you get with cover open or cover closed. That's cover open. So if you want to take a picture, you gotta leave it flapping in the wind here, or I guess pull it up a little bit. But you can't. Yeah. So. Um, so you know, you know, pluses and minuses, right? Like it's a great case, uh, a lot of great features on it. Covering the front is amazing, but um, harder to use the camera, harder, you know, harder to get to the volume controls. So, just pull this guy up here. So, there we go. Okay, let's put it back on. Okay, Jeez, I don't know how these videos take so damn long. So like I'm trying to move quickly, but it just doesn't always happen that way, I guess. But moving on to uh, final case uh, that I have here, and this is definitely uh, one of my uh, most highly, you know, my more highly recommended cases, and that is the OtterBox. Uh, now the OtterBox, great cases. Uh, you know, awesome, awesome design um, with the two steps. So you've got the rubber case that fits over like so, very simply. And then you have the hard shell um, that is going to um, give you um, impact protection and scratch protection. The, the rubber shell is going to protect against shock um, and dust and other elements uh, of that type. Whoop. Damn it. Totally put this on backwards. Oh, we're just gonna we're just gonna work with it. Okay, so apparently we're not gonna work with it. We're gonna take it off. So when you're putting this case on, you wanna start at the top and then work your way down. Because if you do it the opposite way, as you saw. This button, this you know, this pull tab here, which is for covering up the uh, headphone jack, uh, will get stuck, and it's going to get stuck underneath here, and it's going to be all ridiculous. Pull tab here on the bottom doesn't get stuck because it goes the opposite way, and that's for your USB port. 
So, uh, moving right along here. Um, pros of uh, pros of this guy here. Um, like I said, dual protection. Uh, camera is super recessed. Like you can see, like whew, it is way down there, which is awesome. You know, don't have to worry really at all about putting it on any kind of surface without scratching, you know, and scratching the camera lens. Um, as well, of course, has the uh, you know hole for your ice pen, which you know is you know pretty key. But sometimes you know things like that can be uh, overlooked. And I guess I will mention um, all these cases here um, do have the slot for the S Pen. Now, as well, you know the extra added protection, as I mentioned, um, covers up the USB port, so you're not going to be getting any liquid or moisture in there. Uh, as well, uh, covering up your headphone jack. So you're not going to be getting any stuff in there. Um, buttons are very, you know, buttons are easy to access. Um, so you've got full use of the phone. Um, drawbacks on this guy, expensive. This one's 30, uh, 30, or sorry, 45 99 um, And for a bulky phone, it definitely is even bulkier now. That is for sure. You know, we look at the profile here, it's like, bam. This thing's like twice as thick now. But twice as protected. One of the other great things though uh, about the uh, OtterBox case is it comes with a screen protector and that is the screen protector I have on the phone currently um, and it's great. It's um, you know it's cut you know it's cut in a way so that it's uh, you know it's uh, covers the entire screen but it's small enough it's cut small enough around the edges that it's easy to apply it's very thick as well as comparably to the Incipio uh, that I mentioned and is not going to uh, hence get scratched up by your S Pen. Now I did try the eye shield, uh, more rubbery um, uh, skin on here, uh, or sorry, uh, screen protector, and as soon as I hit it with the S Pen, well, marked it right up and just couldn't use it. Because you know, as soon as you touch with the S Pen, it would get all marked up and it just looked retarded. So, all in all, OtterBox is definitely uh, one of my uh, biggest recommendations um, for a mix of you know, protection and, um, and ease of use. Um, right behind that though um, is the Incipio here and uh, just because you know, it looks great. So for, you know, so for looks factor and ease of use, uh, OtterBox and the Incipio. So that's, uh, so that's uh, just a quick overview of uh, some of the cases, well no it wasn't quick, it was like 15 minutes. <laughs> so that was a um, long and drawn out overview of the uh, case options you got for the Galaxy Note. Um, so uh, if you want to know more about the Galaxy Note, tips, tricks, all kinds of you know cool stuff, stupid stuff, whatever, um, check me out at uh, youtube.com slash cellphoneintel and that's with one L or um, hit, well sorry, and hit up the Facebook page and that is facebook.com slash cell phone intelligence. Hit the like button, like it, just do it, and I will love you forever, and uh, your phone will never break as well. That's part of it. <laughs> so uh, I'm Caleb, and this has been your cell phone intelligence. So uh, until next time. <laughs>